we, we can't keep going the way we are at the minute. We need to think of different ways to use energy. If the climate crisis is to be solved, students need to have the opportunity to see what solutions look like. Having solar panels is the start of that. We wanted to be environmentally friendly and also to cut costs as much as we could. Gas and electric is such a major cost and if there's something out there that can save us money that is risk-free and easy to implement then I would suggest to all schools to go for it. We're Solar for Schools. Our main aim is to put solar panels on all the schools in England and even the world. But for today, we're focusing on Barncroft Primary School here in East London. We're going to put 162 panels on Barncroft. That should save the school quite a lot of money. Solar for Schools helps the school navigate its way through the process of getting solar onto their roofs. Solar for Schools were absolutely fantastic to work with. They guided us along each step of the journey. As we can see, there's a nice high flat bit over here. That's a great place to put some solar panels. We take the hassle out of putting solar panels on the school. We look after everything from start to finish, from the machines coming in, the fencing, the scaffolding. The planning applications that have to go in with the local authority. We take all that hassle off the school and they just have to enjoy the power that the panels bring. Solar for Schools gives schools an opportunity to get solar panels in the way that they want to. They can invest in them, they can look to us to invest in them, or they can part own them. And it's really up to them which way they want to go. There's no right way or wrong way, it's the way that they want to do it and the way they feel comfortable. Well, having this sort of funding from socially minded investors makes the impossible possible for schools that don't have capital for investment in renewable technologies. The solar panels cost us nothing. We didn't have the capital backup to be able to go ahead and purchase the solar panels ourselves as a school. However, we were still keen to know that we could make savings financially for the school in the long term, which is really important for us. And this option meant there was no risk to us at all. The solar panels here have really helped the school reach more of a carbon neutral footprint. Two-thirds of the electricity that the solar panels are generating is used directly in this school. So it's making a big impact. One of the reasons why we wanted solar panels was to lower the energy cost for the school. So here we're going to have around 70 kilowatts up on this roof, which is going to have a massive impact on the school's finances. We've actually saved about £10,000, which is a great amount of money for our first year of having solar panels. Once I started working with the Solar for Schools team, I realised that they had all of the knowledge, they had a way of raising the money, and that they would also use our solar panels as a tool for education, which was the most important part of all. We set up Solar for Schools with the aim of educating the next generation on energy and decarbonisation. Putting solar panels on a school and then using the solar panels and the revenue from those solar panels to enable that education is the idea behind Solar for Schools. Solar for Schools provides education around energy and sustainability, so there's a long-term impact of the school having those panels on their rooftops. When we first showed the children the solar panels, a lot of them did not know what they were. So, like, wow, what are those on the, you know, on the roof? We've done a lot of lessons in, in school based on what they do, you know, how they generate electricity. The children have, have learned a lot from doing it, especially from the workshops and the assembly. So energy comes in different forms. When we go into a school and a school has solar technology, students inside get excited, inspired. We encourage their learning, we encourage that excitement by offering in-class workshops and really try to keep them inspired and engaged. We can look at our solar production on a website which is linked to our solar panel so the students can see what we're producing in real time. What's really exciting is it would give students that incentive to see how through their lives, green energy will make a difference to them. Higher up school year fives and sixes are now looking at how in the future, if more schools and more houses do have solar panels, how that could lower the carbon footprint. When they go out into the world, they can actually apply some of the principles about sustainable education and really develop their own careers looking at caring for the world and knowing what it's all about. Having the children really come on board and see the impact themselves, I think that's really rewarding. That's what we're all here for. I've like gone back to my mum and my dad and taught them new things that they didn't know. So if students know that we're in a point of crisis and they learn about it, they're going to be able to go home 
and spread the word. So they're gonna play a big role in our transition. I do think more schools should come on board. You know, we have a lot of roof space, and I would say to any schools wanting to do it, you know, the, the process was really smooth, everybody's very supportive. I'd recommend it to, to anybody. Investors will be comforted by the fact that they're doing a lot of good for the environment, for schools, for school children, and educating them about the importance of climate change. This additional return, less tangible, but nevertheless very important, is something that I feel will appeal to a lot of investors. By getting solar onto your school, it empowers students to actually think, gosh, I can do something locally to reduce my carbon, and that's helping nationally to meet targets, and that's globally helping us to reduce carbon emissions. And it's empowering young people to actually have that opportunity to have a say in their future and what it's going to look like. It's definitely a great thing to do. There are no negatives. It's great for the students, they're so involved, but also for the school. You're gonna save a ton of money and you're doing something great for the environment. There's really no reason not to go ahead and do it. If what we do resonates with you and you'd like to join us and find out more about how you too could be involved with these projects, come and join our community and register at Solar for Schools.